this is thanks so much to systemic reaction for sponsoring today's stream this is ravenbound now in beta we're getting an early first look it's a twitch premiere okay so it's a beta we will have watermarking on the screen thanks so much for this opportunity let's discover this game together shall we in ages long forgotten the island of Avol was a great flourishing garden, tended to by its protectors, the six gods of all that was. Their people knew no struggle, and their craft shone with potential. But the mind of the sixth god became twisted, and her heart turned on her brothers and sisters. There's always one. All souls should be hers she thought, and buried seeds of her malice and might over death into the very fabric of our vault, watching as it ate into the minds of all living things. The blessings of the remaining gods shielded those who were awash with their light, but all others fell to the hatred and would do so forevermore. In a desperate attempt to stop the spread, the Elri came together forged a weapon, a being, in the form of a raven that could carry their shared might against their lost All right, sister. so that's what the raven is. But the creation of the weapon left the Elri exposed. A weakness that the betrayer could not ignore. She took this chance to strike them down and imprison their immortal souls in tombs of her making, deep below the earth. Satisfied with her success, the betrayer retreated into the heart of our vault, from where she would siphon the hatred from the world into herself. Yet the incomplete raven's weakened existence went unnoticed. Within its temple, it bides its time, lying in wait for champions strong enough to host its broken form. And through them, the raven should fulfill its purpose and end the betrayer's reign once and for all okay so we get to be a hero that stumbles upon this raven spirit that's weakened we fight things to make it stronger and then we die and then the raven waits for somebody else and eventually the raven hopefully will be powerful enough to take over the sixth okay got it tutorial raven bound deep in the forest of Murkskog, at the very center of Avold lies a curious island Rumors speak of the great challenge and even greater treasure that hides within its caves, available only to the strongest of the strong. But from the moment a warrior's feet touch the island shore, their fate is set. Fall beneath the weight of the challenge or rise to heights unseen since times of old. It is time for what was lost to be reclaimed. Dun 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 dun! And this is us. Okay. Black hair, red beard. This is pretty. And he immediately drowns in the water. There's fish. All right. That's my boat. I'm assuming I have no way to get up here. Sprint with left stick. Okay, we can run. Another champion approaches. Face my challenges and prove that you have what it takes to become my vessel. Okay. I will do so. You guys heard that, right? Main quest waypoints. I appreciate you. It'd be funny if the first guy just falls in the cliff and dies. We get some other random person. Yeah. Show me you can defeat any foe in your way. Oh, God. All right. I'm not nervous. You're nervous. All right. I can lock on. Hit the enemy using primary attack. Primary! Okay, jump, then use secondary attack to perform a knockback. All 
Alright, alright, alright. Proposal, unfortunately, no. I don't. But welcome. Glad you're here. You can set the camera to automatically target an enemy. Right stick is lock on. Press to switch target, hold to stop targeting. Okay, seems pretty straightforward. Yeah. Hey, Ace of Gods, what's up? Greetings. Welcome. Yeah, if this, uh, if this game looks interesting to you, please go wishlist it to support our sponsor today. You can do it through the link that Evil Twinling just put there in the chat, or click the pretty Raven Mountain picture in my profile. Oh, that's the guard break. Okay, hold down right trigger for the guard. How'd that guy die? He was just impressed by my aura. Ooh. What is this Apex Connect ID thing? Uh, I had to create an account uh, to log in. And that's a watermark because this is a beta. And they don't want people sharing things that shouldn't or aren't authorized to be shared. Yeah. That'll be on the screen. All right, left trigger to dodge. I was not expecting that. You unlock the perfect dodge. If you dodge right before an enemy hits you, it becomes a perfect dodge. Is that perfect? It gives you a huge temporary damage increase. Ow, you jibip. Okay, here we go. South Paul Gemini, congratulations on the game ball game. Systemic, you have to lead for a while. Try not to die while you're gone or do. I'm a dev, not a cop. <laughs> thanks so much for being here and hanging out with us. Hopefully you can check out the stream a little bit later, but thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Thanks for answering questions for us. Now quick, think of all the questions you wanted to ask them. All right, let's read this. It is known, it is unknown how the Elri came into being, only that they came together to forge the island of a vault and task themselves with guarding its people. Those who follow them know no pain and want for nothing. We give them our faith, our loyalty, and in return, they teach us to guard us against any encroaching darkness. Hey, I got legacy points. I got, I got some things for that. Check the codex, a reminder of what you've learned. Codex? First trial complete. All right, one challenge completed. Let's see how you fare when I lend you some real power. Man, this game's pretty. Make your way through the challenges. Zero of five. Can you go into settings? Do you know why I'm asking? I don't think there's any difficulty settings. Those are the game settings right now. Delete save game in text language. By the way, I went through these settings before the stream. This is the first game I've played in a long, long time that had motion blur set to off by default. So can we give them a round of applause? <sighs> like, I don't mind that it's an option for those weirdos out there. <laughs> But turn it off by default. Uh, Bay, thanks for following. Stone of the Beginnings 1, Betrayal. By the mind of the Sixth God become t became twisted. But the mind of the Sixth God became twisted and her heart turned on her brothers and sisters. All souls should be hers, she thought, and buried seeds of her malice and might over death into the very fabric 
of a vault, watching as it ate into the minds of all living things. I like that they give you something for reading all those things. All right, so they want me to go this way. Can I go this way? I don't think I can jump up there, can I? You got this. You can do it. You can do it. No. I love the little fishies in there. Can you drown? I haven't tested that yet because I think the answer is probably yes. <laughs> I haven't run into the water though. Well, maybe at some point. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to die in this tutorial. That's embarrassing, and happens way too often on this stream. Uh, you unlocked guard. The Raven's guard prevents damage. If it takes too much damage, you will become overwhelmed. LB. The time has come. Execute resub sixty six. Scare the crap out of me. Thank you for the 66 months, honeybee. You're awesome. Did you know? I think you knew. But I'm telling you anyway. You're awesome. This really looks like at least a $40 game. The, the price that uh, that they told me was $29.99. I mean, things can change. It's still a beta. But, but yeah. Looks great. Looks incredible. Hello. Hello. Okay. Perform a perfect guard to block an enemy's attack. It's hard to do it perfectly. What do you think of that? It's like beating the crap out of them. There we go. Holy moly. That is an awesome, awesome, visceral sound effect and everything. Oh, we got coins for breaking pottery. Now I immediately think about, did I pass lots of these? Did I pass lots of these already? And not take the treasure? No. Probably, I know, right? <laughs> the hunting for potteries has begun. It has. All right, we got a magic bubble. That's pretty cool. Time to not leave any tracers for future archaeologists. That's right. All right, 105 challenges. You unlocked focus. Focus is built up by actions in combat, but it'll be lost if inactive. Your focus is tracked by the blue bar in the lower left corner. Okay. Accumulate full focus, then surge. B is surge. Okay. Full focus, then surge. Hi! Surge! Surging will drain your focus, but give you a huge temporary damage increase. All right. Future archaeologists aren't giving us coins now. That's true. No jumping? There is jumping. Yeah. Whee! Whee! Item acquired. You unlock the Raven's Talon. You can use this tool to reach higher places. Oh, snap. Use the Raven's Talon. It's X. All right. <laughs> See how good I am at that? Oh, I actually did get up there somehow. 
Do it again. Okay. All right. Spider-Man. There you go. Hey, Nick Torellis. What's up? Saw the news update, Steve, and there's a Twitch sneak peek. I know. Isn't that cool? I'm so... I, I didn't even know they were going to do that for my channel. Welcome to the stream. Glad you're here. Yeah, if anybody's uh, new to the stream, my name is Richie, a.k.a. Bog Otter. I'm a full-time uh, variety streamer here on Twitch. I've been doing this seven and a half years full-time. And I play a huge variety of games. I love roguelites. I love Souls-likes. This seems like a combination of both. And uh, very excited to be checking this out today for the first time. I'm going to butcher your name, but hey, YN Sem. Sem? Can I call you Sem? Sem Reckon? Okay. All right, so there we go. We were able to loop all the way back around here. Now we can get up that other way that we saw. I can call you Emery. All right, Emery. Damn you work. Let me check out the cool game. I know Glacial Sin. Do you want me to call your work for you? I can do that. That's a service I provide. Yeah. Amateur genius, you keep dying. Should I be going straight to the boss or doing a bunch of fights first? I am still in the tutorial. I have no idea. But my instinct would tell you tell me that it's an open world game. So if you're you're stuck on a boss. Um, or you're stuck like going for the boss explore the world and see if you can find some cool items to level your character up or uh, Advance things, but yeah, I'm, I just started. I have no idea All right, they want me to go up here first Elites are stronger variants of enemies Their type and difficulty are indicated by the icon on the left of their health bar common enemy Rare, and then Legendary Elite. Hello. Okay, so this guy is a Rare Elite. What do you want? What do you want? Yeah. I staggered you. Elites drop fragments depending on their element and rarity. Can I have a fragment? I would like fragment. I would like this. That up for me. Fragments appear in the lower left corner. You need to find three fragments to use them. All right. Toast Ghost, you like the Viking setting? Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, where do they want me to go next? I could. What happens if I just go the wrong way? Surviving combat using Dodge and Raven's Garden is essential for staying alive. Keep Keep your focus high. chest oh there's a chest nice oh that is that is fancy choose a reward spark with this game's got cards yeah what is that fractal you keep seeing on top that's one of my sponsors fractal design they make gaming cases um one does not simply walk into 64. Bulger, thanks for the 64 month resub I hope you're having a great day. Thank you. 
Um, so lost mana, gain two mana. All right, when you pick up a card, it is added to your hand. Play the select. This is a zero cost bounty card. Play the card. Sorry. Sorry for the cracking. Um, the card played gave you mana, which is used to play more powerful cards. Exit the hand screen to find more powerful card to play. Okay. This is interesting. I was not expecting that. There are many cards, and most of them cost mana to play. Try to find a new card to spend your mana. Wow. Okay. I kind of love that. I want to find a shiny Psyduck. Hmm? These kind of cards you can deal with, Sparkwind? King of the Hill. I wonder if, like, you can actually hurt yourself by grappling. Like, too high. Is there fall damage? That crack was so satisfying sounding. It it was, uh, it was necessary <laughs> for me to keep playing. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. What's up, Airwolf? How you doing? Welcome. Good afternoon to you. All right, we're in the tutorial still. Four out of five challenges done. What, what's next? What's next? Hello. Oh, that was me. Sorry for spinning the camera. our third fragment you have collected three fragments and are able to empower them empowering fragments lets you draw three cards from your deck i have a deck mm. are the cards one time used or do you build a deck and cycle through i don't know yet nicked i have no idea let's 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 figure it out together i thought it was gonna be three of the exact same card and that would have been funny as hell yeah, we're finding out together. I haven't played this before today. I'm still, I'm still learning. All right, mercenaries armor health increased by thirty percent, and then worn arms. That seems less good. Uh, when you empower fragments, the cards drawn are based on the elements and rarities of the fragments you picked up. Okay, select a card. You can compare equipment. All right, so I have a sword and shield. All right, I'm going to choose Mercenary's Armor. You selected an equipment card. You should play this card, which will consume mana. Okay, so this is going over my 10 armor. I'm assuming. Yes, it's going over my Traveler's Armor, which seems to do very little. Let's play it. You played the card and the vessel's old equipment got replaced. You can now close the screen. Okay. And I still have mana, one mana on the top right. Is that what that means? I guess, right? That only costs one. And I look different. I've got a helmet on. All right, cool. Interesting way of doing loot. I wonder what the coins like. Where, where I can spend them. How do you obtain more mana? That that first card I got gave me two mana. It was a zero cost card. 
That gave me two mana. Yeah. This game has grapple hooks, cards, and corn. It has corn? It has the juice? I didn't know that. Hey, Platty, what's going on? Thanks for following. All right. Now where do they want me to go? Over this way. Find a way to the final challenge. But was there a way to go in? Oh, wait. Let's get this. The blessing of the remaining gods shielded those who were awash with their light, but all others fell to the hatred and would do so forevermore. In a desperate attempt to stop the spread, the Elri came together and forged a weapon, a being in the form of a raven that could carry their shared might against their lost sister. And we got little currency for reading. Gang, don't skip the lore in this game. You get stuff. Yeah. Oh, this is where I started. Oh, how cool. We've come first full circle. I broke a pot and I got eight corn, did I? I didn't even see the corn. I missed it. Sounds rough. Do we know if loot cards are randomly generated? I would assume so, because this is a roguelite, so you're going to go on different runs. You're, you're expected to die and start over, and the cards that you collect from your previous run will carry over. Some way, same, some, 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 there's some things that you're going to unlock that will be available to you in future runs. But I haven't died yet. I don't know. This is my first time playing, so let's see. Yeah. Hey, Lady Dino, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Platy says, just a gentle dev reminder to any beta testers here. Please remember your NDA and only troubleshoot and share info in designated Discord channels. Okay, that's a good point. That is a good point. Imagine if they paid you in real life to read books. This in video games are better than reality. I know, right? I'm glad you're loving the stream so far, Platy. We have so many new folks here. It's really great. Thanks for being here, everybody. If anybody, um, Twitch runs ads on my channel, gang, um, my subscribers don't get any ads. So if they're bugging you and you have like a prime gaming sub, you can sub for free. Um, get rid of those ads. All right. You unlocked the graves. Hey, Marauder, what's up? The game looks beautiful. It does. The graphics are awesome. All right, graves contain unplayed cards from other players who previously died here. What? Unplayed card? Oh, what? You're going to be able to see other players that, like, died? That's awesome. Oh, no worries, Marauder. Yeah, no, I have no way to uh, turn all those off at once. So bloodstains with swag. Yes. Consume the hatred. Jagged Thimble. Oh, no, it's like Monopoly. Weapon damage increased by 20%. Now, how does a Thimble accomplish that, you wonder? Um, 75 coins. I'm going to go with damage. That is huge. Grabbing that, and I'm going to cast that. I have one mana, right? Cast that. Yes. All right. So here we go. We seem to have like passive slots that we can unlock over here. It protects your thumb so you can do more damage. It makes sense. I think. <laughs> but the creation of the weapon left the Elri exposed, a weakness that the betrayer could not ignore. She took the chance to strike them down and imprison their immortal souls in tombs of her making deep below the earth. Satisfied with her success, the betrayer retreated into the heart of a vault from where she would siphon the hatred from the world into herself. So she's basically like, I've won. I'm just going to sit here and suck up all the hate. Nobody will ever rise up against me. That's a mistake. Imagine you swing your sword at someone and it does 100 damage, then you flick them with your thimble finger and it does 20. Oh, okay. It's a flick. Got it. Yeah. Maybe it was a thimble full of whiskey. It might make me able to think I can do more damage. There it is. 
Mm -hmm. You always read the lore, Lady Dino. I uh, I try to always read it, and I I read a lot of it out loud on my stream as well, unless it gets overwhelming. Some some games you go into a library, and it's really a library. Multiple elites. Some enemy camps have more than one elite, making them dangerous but valuable camps. Oh, okay. Hello. I'm here to fight. I do 20%. Feel my thimble! Yeah. I think that guy just stabbed me in my butt and hurt himself. I like that. All right, here's a fragment. Here's a fragment. And another. You have collected three fragments. We're able to empower them again. Okay. I love, I love the items in this game. They're so surprising. Bronze ear hook? <laughs> My thimble and ear hook. <laughs> that looks like a dangerous earring. Holy crap. Okay. Um, which one do I want? Do I want the guard health increased by 100%? The guard health increased by 100% or the guard health increased by 100%? This one. You've drawn relics. Once played, relics are active passively. Select the card. Played relic cards are added to your reliquary. Relics in the reliquary can be removed. Oh. Okay. Soul beers are. I'll have the chicken, please. Yeah. You don't have enough mana to play this card yet. Chess gives you bounty cards. They can give you mana. Okay. So I can't play this because I played the thimble. So we'll just keep it. And I think that is an unplayed card. So if I die, somebody else can find my grave and get that card. There we go. I should have gone with the guard health increased by 100%. Damn it, I knew it. I always choose the wrong one. Okay, those are strong ass barrels. Actually, they're not. They're normal barrels. Barrels are strong, especially reinforced ones like that. We just get so used to breaking everything in games. We think barrels should crumble between our might. You ever hit you ever hit a barrel? A real barrel with anything? It'll break. Not easily. The background music's incredible, isn't it? Mr. Snipe says, any release date yet? No, no, this is a beta. They don't, they haven't revealed any release date information yet. Six coins. Are you sure I picked up corn and not coins? Yeah, clay pots, however. Don't underestimate the power of the barrel side. All right, jump and climb to reach further. Oh, there's a climb button? They were just cheeky and didn't tell me about it until now. You cheeky little monkeys. And those are some large barrels? Why, thank you. Is that what they mean by climb? Yeah. It wasn't really a climb. That was that was the grapple we already got. Yeah. I thought they meant there was a different ability called climb. I thought he was literally gonna go. Yeah. You're looking at the Steam page in a separate tab, you think you love the premise of the game, so wish list. Yeah, please. That's what they that's why they wanted me to play this game on Twitch today. They wanted to see how many wish lists they could drum up 
So type hashtag game or click the little uh, Ravenbound um, picture in my profile and that'll tell the devs that you wishlisted it through finding my channel and that would be amazing. Is this more a story aligned game or a sandbox? Um, it's got a story, but it's a open world roguelite. You're gonna do, you're gonna, you're gonna go until you die. Your next character will be more powerful based on how far you got and what you unlocked. You can unlock new character classes, new items and things like that. Um, so not really a sandbox where you can kind of just do anything. It's not like a, it's not like a crafting game like that. It's an action open world roguelite. Yeah. You have a dive attack and there's no fall damage. Oh man. Hey, Roxy. Jokes on them. I found you through them rather than the other way around. You know what? It's a it's a symbiotic relationship. We're helping each other out today. I love elevators in games. Like, has there ever ever been a point in history where we have had an elevator like this in real life? The Raven says, together we will seek out their tombs, free their immortal souls, and gain something. They all sound this way, too. Imagine if you die and you have to start this tutorial again. I'm hoping that that's not the case. And I have a feeling that that's not the case. Becoming a vessel. Make your way to Svali in the Tomb of Gales and gain his blessing. Active bio modifier on holy grounds. Your luck is reduced by 50%. Hey! That's not very fun. Okay, so so the uh, the different bosses are in the different tombs. We're allowed to go through the entire Tomb of Gales um, and explore the open world. But we're, we can't, we're not allowed to go into the next tomb. So, first tomb only. Holy crap, I'm a raven now. What? Svali has sensed our arrival. I believe he was torn open the very ground. Oh, those things need to be voiced or slower. That is... I was not expecting this. What? Guides you to objective in the main quest. Guides you to side quests. What is this? Decrease speed, increase speed. Okay, this is pretty amazing. I didn't expect to actually become the Raven. <laughs> at least not this early um so yeah i guess part of the strategy is going to be like where do you go after do you just do you just jump down on one of these points what is this over here transform that is awesome Gara, the pl platform, they've only announced Steam right now. Yeah. Oh, that's how I transform again. Raven Towers. Find the old Raven Towers and walk into the wind to transform. Okay. So. Oh, look at this. How did I manage that? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, my first run is going to be dead right there. <laughs> I don't think anyone's going to be able to get my corpse yet either there. All right, so. 
Reminder, this is a beta. Um, start over. Are you sure you want to start over? You will lose your progress. As long as I don't have to do the tutorial again. There's nothing I'm going to be able to do here, right? I hear something whispering at me. All right, here we go. Hey, Kilroy, what's going on? We're finding bugs. Um, start over. The vessel has fallen. Our first death. Damage taken. Damage dealt. Clear time. Combat score. All right. We, we, we want to see what carries over anyway. All right. We want to see what happens. Okay. We got 50 of these things. Ascension reward. We got to kill 50 Utlagi. Okay. Okay. And we unlocked Lucky Arms or Critical Hits. Temporarily grants 50 luck. Okay, these are the cards, I guess. The ones that are colored in are the ones that are unlocked. Traits. Oh, I could spend points. What is this first point here? Sword and Shield Specialist. Long Sword Specialist. Humans. Olvar. And Simlar. You can unlock... Those look like races. Can I unlock... Unlock the deer person. Sweet googly moogly, three months in a row? Are you feeling all right? Seize the pony. Oh. Uh, thank you so much for the three months. Red says, don't get folk, you unlock those for free later. That's okay. That's all right. You know what? We all play games. We all make mistakes. We all, we got to discover these things for ourselves. Um, uh, thanks, Seize a pony. All right, let's try again. Reroll vessels. There we go. So humans, whenever you drain a card, you gain 50 coins. And the similar, whenever you drain a card, you gain one mana. Interesting. Okay, sword and shield specialist. All right, let's try it. Did I just re-roll? I just re-rolled on accident. Um, and these are the exact same. So we just go with whatever color we like better. I re-rolled because I'm using a PS5 controller and the buttons are different. <laughs> I like that. Hey, Malin, what's going on? All right, the Betrayer. With every vessel that falls, the Raven watches from the shadows as the Betrayer's hatreds ebb and flow across a vault. The tombs of its creators lie darkened, the lands outside fraught with danger. The Raven waits, and the Raven watches. Will the next vessel be the one? I think the next vessel's the one, for sure. Yeah. All right, cool. We get to start right here, so we didn't really lose much in the way of progress. Herds! Hey, look, I got Herds right here on this character. We're Smoogle. We got Hearns. There we go. Which of these doors leads out? There we go. This one. Okay. That is kind of crazy. That was really close to the ground. All right, should I go? So the main, wait, which one was main? Was it the one on the left was the main quest and the one on the right was the side? Forget. That camera angle hurt your head, it hurt me too. Yellow is main. So should we try the side quest then? 
Thanks, Queen. What do you guys think? Side or main? Oh, there's lots of other markers too. Yeah. Side quest? All right, let's do a side quest. Let's go. What are the little helmets? I have no idea. Yeah, gang, we have uh, we have devs in the chat watching. This is my first time playing the game. I know nothing about it. I know some folks may have played the beta, but there's an NDA for the beta. So please don't spoil things. Don't backseat game. Just let me enjoy it and make mistakes and just uh, enjoy the ride. Thank you. And how do I stop? And I'd like to stop. I stopped. And I graze on flowers. All right. Is everything in here want to kill me? Or are we going to have friends? Oh, we have friends. Hello. From time to time, weary travelers or ambitious explorers find themselves in possession of relics of old, quite useless most of them but your appearance tells me you find some use of them what will it be something simple or something worth more gamble 100 coins do i have 100 coins i will gamble 100 coins you do not carry coins enough to warrant me opening my bag at all sorry i died in the tutorial i don't have any coins sorry They took control of my character. I guess I am going toward the quest. I'm going slightly past the quest. That was really odd. Okay, here we go. Bjork! The constant battle for this land is getting on my nerves. I have long said that we cannot live side by side with the barbaric Utlagi. Not when they attack our lands in the night. My farm is but the last in their conquest. The farms need to be reclaimed so we can feed our people. All right. Let's do it. Side quest waypoints. Guys you to an objective in side quests. Okay. Purchase healing. Do I have 50 coins? I don't think I have any. I have named my price for aid, and if you cannot pay it, please be off. Oh, man. The first place you go after the tutorial is Vegas. <laughs> uh... Okay, this is where I need to go, right? I feel like every time... <laughs> I feel like every time I'm in the Raven form, I'm gonna crash land somewhere. Um, what is the button to land? <laughs> I come in hot every time. Coming in hot! Um... Raven's Talon reduce fight speed X. Exit Raven form B. Okay. There we go. Woo! Oh boy. These guys mean business. Oh, that was butterflies. <laughs> Suddenly butterflies. Okay. Give me that. Need fragments. 
Oh, I had my uh, ability to hit the focus, but it ran out. There we go. Now I can get it. Minions of hatred defeated. Is that everything? Okay. I got two of those relic things. Is there fall damage if you exit Raven form too high up? I don't think so, but I haven't fully tested that yet. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't beat up the homestead I'm probably here to protect. Probably a good thing. Ooh, look at this. Sparkly. Oh. Consume hatred. <laughs> I grapple hook it. Can I consume the hatred? Do it, consume. I'm trying. I don't know how. Do I have a consume hatred button? <laughs> it's a very specific button. Uh... Why? Here we go. Reinforce armor. Increase the armor of currently equipped armor by three. Gain 75 coins. Or increase the original base damage of currently equipped weapon by 10%. What do you guys think? Coins. I don't have the mana to summon any of these. This will just be a card we keep. Yeah. Let the hate flow through you. I know. I wonder what what was up by, what what's bad about consuming hate. Coins, 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 coins. Golomancy says, blades. Coins. Um. Sure, we'll get coins. The chat has spoken. Okay. So we got that camp. Now the now they're telling me to go over here. There's no map, right? So now we walk back. And see kind of things we what kind of trouble we can get in. Twitch integration for the card select would make this game interesting. You know what? That's not a bad idea. Oh, shit. You unlock stagger. Multiple attacks in rapid succession can stagger characters. Specific attacks are more likely to stagger, and certain enemies are hard to stagger. Experiment to learn how to avoid it yourself and how to exploit it against your enemies. I guess these are bad guys. Are you guys bad? Yeah, you're bad. Hi. I like how they watch me kill their friend. You're staggered. Now I'm a glowy stag. I cannot carry any more fragments. Are you sure? Choose a reward. Flint earrings, bronze ear hook, fragment of hatred. On reveal, elites and bosses gain 5% increased health and damage. Why would I pick that one? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I have permission to stream it despite the watermark gag. Yeah, I promise. It's on the Steam store page and everything. Yeah. It takes effect the moment you draw it, not choose it. Oh. Oh, so that happens regard. Okay, so that was the thing I got when I opened up that cursed chest. 
That's what I got. Okay. So it's so I'm not going to choose that one. It just happens. Okay. That makes sense. Stagger impact increased by 70%. Guard health increased by 100%. Let's get the flint earrings. I still have no mana, so I can't play the cards. And I can collect this first fragment and the second fragment. Okay. Got it. So, so in the bottom left, you see the fragments. When I get three fragments, I can choose a reward. I had uh, two of these normal fragments and one of those funky looking ones, one of the hatred ones. And um, that's why I got that as one of the option reveals, yeah. Congratulations, difficult 1.2. Yes. All right, so now I can go over here and I can fly again. I feel like the... Um... What was that old, like, 80s sitcom? Believe it or not, I'm walking on air. I feel like him when I'm flying. Like, he crash lands into everything. The greatest American hero. Yes, that's what I feel like. <laughs> Believe it or not. Ah! Okay, that was actually pretty, pretty slick. All right. What are the red beams in the distance? I think that's either where the the mad god, like the sixth bad god is sitting there consuming hatred or it's one of the dungeons. The dungeons are uh, where you face the the bosses and stuff such. All right, so there we go. We did we did the thing for you. Well fought. The farms can start back up now that the immediate danger has passed, but we must figure out a better solution to all this and soon. A hundred coins. Nice. Hey, Terrorless, thanks for following. All right, we've got we've got coins now. I could buy I, I could buy a, a potion of healing. Um or I could gamble it. <laughs> Wait, how much gold do I got? Um wait, where was the inventory? I don't know what I just did. What is the button to see my inventory? settings pause my new inventory is this one ah that's weird it doesn't work maybe because i'm on a playstation controller ps5 button yeah maybe i don't know uh, okay so i can't look at my inventory if i'm playing on the ps5 controller right now or maybe because i'm in that weird screen select yeah I'm, I'm hitting it it's not working and the touchpad doesn't work either that's okay I'll figure it out what is this long ago to said the power of the relics will you keep uncovering could enhance tenfold through proper use proper use in this case being proper storage buy a reliquary place it whatever you wish inside and see that same power return only potentially of course i make no promises um so is this something you can save something for a future run maybe oh hit oh yeah i can just hit it on my keyboard good call good call mr snipes how much gold do i got i got 100 gold okay so pocket an item lose it now get it later that's what it sounds like that's what that sounds like all right what else where was the gambling guy I could get a healing potion or we can gamble it all the way. So hungry. I thought he. I didn't do that. So sorry. Oh, here he is. He's up the hill. I'm running up that hill. Gonna gamble all my gold. Press on D pad, right key. Oh, that makes it. So what does that do? What is that weird mode? Okay, gamble 100 coins. Yes! Choose a reward. We got the jagged thimble back. Sunken ship miniature. 
or flint earrings. Let's go with the thimble. Got it. You can see near, you can see a place. It wasn't explained yet. No, I might not have just gotten to it. That part of the tutorial yet. Yeah. We reclaimed our lost thimble. I can't cast it yet because I have no mana still, but wait, are there wolf people too? Oh, there are. Teen Wolf. Sweet. I throw. All right, well, I have no gold now. Time to explore more. just run out right or I can go to the next I could fly around but let's see what happens if we walk around I like the this part of the game like I don't know much about it so everything's kind of like I don't know what I'm gonna find let's go get our, let's go get our butt kicked hello oh that is a nice treasure chest right there it looks like it's full of hatred Clear a hard Utlagi camp. Challenge completed. Hatred diminished. Nice. I like all that. Did they leave me any uh, stuff to pick up? So I have a feeling we're about to get another hatred thing. Oh, here we go. Collect fragment. Now I can activate this fra these fragments. Choose a card with no hatred in it. Wow. Okay. Mercenary armor, gold shackled bottle. When you surge, consume 10% of your coins, which deals three damage by per coin consumed to nearby enemies. How cool is that? Ace of Gods, thanks for following. Um, Four bone needle. Weapon damage increased by 120%. Wow. That costs four mana, though. <laughs> that is one OP sewing needle. It is. It is. Mr. Kingless, thanks for following as well. Welcome, everybody, to the stream. Um, glad to see so many folks excited about this game. We're promoting uh, Ravenbound. It, uh, it is a sponsored segment. They want you to wishlist the game. And if you can wishlist the game by typing hashtag game in the chat or clicking the little picture down below on my Twitch profile, it'll tell them that Bog Otter sent you, and I would appreciate it. I would also appreciate if you're having fun today, hitting that follow button here on the stream. We play a lot of games like this, roguelites, souls likes, lots of indie games. And I stream uh, full time, seven and a half years now. So thanks for being here. Um, which one of these do you guys think? Honestly, if the thimble adds damage, I expected the sewing needle to add armor. I know, right? <sighs> like this one's really nice. But when are we going to get four? When are we going to get four more mana? feel like let's get the armor and then we'll go from there this is going to give us mana right here this is a mana box but i have to get the hatred see the hatred symbol now over there on the bottom left okay all right so ooh, three mana damn so we use that Okay, and now I can put on the thimble. We can put on the armor. And I can either get 75 gold or hold off. Let's just hold off. Yeah, okay, nice. Nice. Full moon.
Oh, moon. Oh, I, I didn't even see there. I got the fra another fragment there. All right. I like how you can immediately, like, fly around as a raven. And, um... You know, explore different quest markers and stuff, or you can just start wandering in a direction. I do want to before I do want to check out the first dungeon at some point as well, which I assume that's where that gold thing's gonna lead me. But let's see this camp here. They've got more hatred over here. So it's funny, the more loot you go after, the more chances for get to get hatred stacks. Oh man, that was a quick attack. Yeah, right. Are they running? Wait, are you running? Do not run. All right, I grab that. All right, we're going to get hate here. <laughs> Another thimble. Key of the strong and 5% more <laughs> health and damage to elites and bosses. Okay. Um, key. Say key to open door. Oh. Uh, whenever you empower fragments, gain one mana. Oh, that was that would be really cool. I'm gonna snag that. I'm gonna snag that. So every time we get three fragments and we empower it, we'll actually gain a mana. Yeah. So what does the hatred symbolize here? Is it good or bad to collect? It's bad to collect, but necessary. The hate, the, the, the story of this world are there were numerous gods and the sixth god decided to rebel against the others. Like, like they do. It's always the sixth. And they uh, they want to soak up all the hatred in the world and become more powerful. Become more powerful. Yeah. Hey, Azaria, what's up? I am a blue deer. Um. So the hatred makes things more powerful, which makes things harder. And I'm gonna just I'm gonna activate this key right away. Um, so we're going to grab this and we're going to activate the key. So now if I get one more relic or hatred, I can get a mana for free, which is nice. Nick Terrorless says, that's it. You're getting my prime sub. I didn't survive to 2023 to look at ads, LMAO. I, uh, I am sorry about the ads. They're necessary evil, unfortunately. Woohoo! We got ourselves a new otter. Welcome to the swamp. <laughs> but that's how you get rid of them right there. Thank you so much for using your prime over here. I appreciate that. Every five newer gifted subs, we do a giveaway here as well. So, uh, four more newer gifted subs and we'll run a giveaway. Yeah. Yeah, but subs get rid of your ads and that way every 30 minutes you won't have an interruption um okay where to next hey Dracina what's up Oh, yeah. Ads are always super loud in comparison to the streams. Yeah, you're right. Absolutely right. Thank you for sub. <laughs> Twilight, thank you so much. Thanks for the 63. Thank you very much for the resub.
Do we want a movie tonight? Let's uh, let's talk about it a little bit later. Yeah. One little, two little, three little gifted subs. Four little, five little, six little gifted subs. Seven little, eight little, nine little gifted subs. Ten gifted. Where are you? Oh my God, Tangerine! Okay, right? Thank you so much, Tangerine. That was super generous of you. Congrats to everybody getting five subs. Five gifted subs. Mr. Kinglis, thank you for the five bomb of subs. You guys are amazing. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's so kind of you guys. Thank you. And now everybody that got hit with those subs will not have ads anymore. And we're going to do a triple giveaway once this hype train is over. I'll talk about the giveaway in a, in a minute or two. Yeah, birthday subs. It's your birthday, Tangerine. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Let's give out. Five gifted subs. Thank you so much, Cuddly Shark. Whoa, what is going on? You heard giveaway, you thought, why not? Thank you so much, everybody. And happy birthday to uh, Tangerine. Let's give out, let's give out, you know what? Let's give out a thousand clams to everybody watching so that all of our new folks can participate in the giveaway when we get, when we get it up and running. Um, and I'm going to fight these guys I just stumbled into. Thanks, Bay. Thanks for the bits. Really appreciate that. And I am low on health. Holy crap. So two of these are look like elites, right? That forward stab like that? Oh, we're gonna die. We are gonna die. That forward stab is uh, difficult to see. Five gifted subs. Oh my God, are you crazy with a five bomb? It is a gift, a gift to the friends of the otters. Thank you, Tangerine. Another one. Whoa, I'm glad I blocked there. Holy cow. Oh my God, I almost died. Jesus. All right, we need healing real bad. Uh, are you crazy? Thanks for the five bomb and uh, Tangerine. Thanks for another gifted sub. All the giveaways indeed. And Twilight's birthday too. Happy birthday. Another happy birthday. Happy birthday. All right, right after this hype train's done, we'll explain how the giveaways work here. Yeah. All right, let's choose a reward, which is going to give us a mana. There's the boar bone needle again. A gleaming endowment. Oh my God. What? Hype train time. Holy crap, Leo. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's amazing. Very generous. Wow. You guys are incredible. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Happy Thursday. <laughs> playing an amazing game hanging out with amazing people and you guys are super generous thank you thank you so much um shield charm i think we gotta go for the needle right let's go for the needle and we gotta figure out a way to heal we gotta go back and spend some money we're gonna get some more hatred here thanks for the bits kaya Appreciate it. Need some coins to get my hit points back. I know I can get coins because I have a coin card. Um, oh, I can pick lost mana right here. Or I can get more coins. Let's take the coins and we'll try to go. We'll try to go heal. All right. I got to get to a, a Raven launch point so I can fly. <laughs> there, oh, no. Actually, the town's right here. The town's actually not too far. So hopefully we don't trip on a rock and die. <laughs> uh, thanks, Royal Leo Knight. I really appreciate it. That's enough mana for the needle. I, I know, but I needed money. 
Imagine dying at the gates or like running over this fire. Wait, is that a bad guy? Are you a good guy or bad guy? From time to time, weary travelers or ambitious explorers find themselves in possession. Oh, okay. Gamble. No, 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 no. I'm not gambling. That was really pretty. Mr. Kevin says, may I ask what kind of indie games do I generally play? I play all kinds of stuff. I like a lot of roguelites. I like anything with a story. I like action roguelites, um, souls likes. Um, recently we've been playing a lot of vampire survivors and vampire survivor games. Um, which have been cropping up like crazy. Um, we played Army of Ruin this week, uh, Lone Ruin, which just came out today. Uh, what else has come out? Nordic Ashes is in early access. But I played all kinds of stuff. And we also played uh, AAA games here as well. We're going to probably be doing, we're going to probably take a look at Forspoken and uh, maybe some, maybe the Dead Space remake. Because I'm really jumpy and suck at horror games. So the community loves it, yeah. Do, do. All right. So, the the music cuts off abruptly there. That's pretty funny. Um, let's get some healing potions. Purchase healing. Can I purchase multiple? Yes. Can I purchase one more? Now, will you tell me how to use healing? How do I how do I use said healing? That's vessel. Oh, it's auto. So that I just waste money. Oh, I thought it was going to be something I can hold and use. Oh, uh, okay. All right. Well, we learned. We got full healing. We all learn together, so you won't make that same mistake. Yeah, I wasted one, but it's okay. All right, that's yeah, okay. All right, so real quick, gang. Um, through your monster support, we're gonna do a, a, a big giveaway. Um, we do this every stream. Every time I get five newer gifted subs or $25 total on tips and bits, we run a giveaway here. And the winner of the raffle um, gets two things. You get a game from our game vault. We have hundreds of games in a vault that have been donated by our community. You can type exclamation point vault and click the link that shows up in chat to see what's up for grabs. Winner gets to choose any game from that vault and I'll send it to you tonight. You just basically have to follow the instructions at the top of the vault Google document if you win and we'll send you whatever game uh, you want. You also get what's called the spark vault key attached to your account. Uh, we track it, you don't have to track anything. Uh, but when you get five Spark Vault keys for winning five giveaways in five separate streams, you can only win one per day. Um, you can choose any game from the Humble Store worth $70 or less. And our very generous community member named Sparkwood will purchase the game for you. This is a promotion that's been going on for a few months. Actually, more than a few months, like six, seven months. But it's going to be ending at the end of February. So watch a bunch of streams. Help support the stream. Enter the raffles when we do them. And then you can trade those keys in for games on the Humble Store. Yeah. $70 USD. Yeah. Yep. And it has to be something on the Humble Store to make it easy to gift. Um, so, but anyway, we're going to run a raffle right now. It's going to be uh, one, two, three, four, five, six winners. Six. We're going we're gonna to pick six winners who will all get a Game Vault game and all get one Spark Vault key. How's that sound? All right, uh, and everyone should have uh, clams. Uh, everyone gets clams by watching the show. I just noticed it's raining. That's pretty cool. Uh, you get clams uh, just by watching the show. We use clams as our currency here because otters love clams. And um, you have to be following in order to win the raffle. So follow, hit that follow button. And that's it. Uh, when, the, uh, when the mods kick off the raffle, you're going to type uh, what everybody else is typing. You'll see. All right, the raffle has begun. Thanks, Marauder. One clam to enter, max of a thousand. Good luck. Just type that. Exclamation point raffle space 1000. If you want to check your clam total, you can, uh, we'll show you how to do that later. But everybody should have a thousand because we uh, gave out a thousand just before the raffle. Hey, Amateur Genius. Thanks for following. 
thanks for all the follows today gang all right so let's go i was just meandering there while explaining that let's go and turn into a raven let's jump up and let's go see what we can find what kind of trouble do we want to get into now let's go maybe wander over to the first dungeon i have no idea if we're anywhere near prepared for that but it'd be cool to maybe check out what the main quest wants us to do Amateur Genius, you'll be watching a lot more of my streams. I appreciate that. We would love to have you. We really, I, I know probably every streamer says this, but we have a really amazing community that likes to hang out here every day. We've gotten to know each other over the years, and we welcome new members all the time. We call ourselves the Ottoman Empire. It's really just a great group of people who love sharing our passions for games and TVs and movies and music. And we have a Discord that you feel free to join. Everyone can join our Discord. Just type exclamation point Discord and uh, join us over there. Yeah. And my kitty cat won't stop pawing you my saw arm. Hype. That's bananas. B A N A N A S. Mr. Snipes, thanks for hitting me up with that prime. You're amazing. You are amazing. Thank you. Um Okay, so this is all the way over here on an island. My cat Fizzgig keeps pawing my arm. I know you guys can't see that, and every time I go to grab him, he's gonna run away from me. All right. Let's see what this quest wants us to do. Oh, this is where we died. Oh, I remember. Let's not fall through the earth this time. What is this ruin? Can you loot your old body? That's a good question. I don't know. Uh, you can loot other people's. That. This is my cat Fizz gig. There are many like him, but this one is mine. And he's bothering me because he wants to go out in the garage. He's very floofy. Oh, maybe I shouldn't fight these guys. Then again, maybe I should. I turned down the music for the game. You missed. I like the shield we get. The shield, that shield bubble is so strong. Nice. Collect fragment. We're gonna get a mana from doing this. We're also gonna get a hatred. Worn arms, bracers of deep stone, fragment of hatred. Worn Arms is going to be slightly better attack than what we have, right? Two minutes left on that raffle, gang. A kind gesture. Thank you for snagging something from my humble link, gang. I know, we don't have any mana. Humble store purchased me for $39.99. Thank you. Um... I guess I'll snag this for now. We want to play this boar needle as soon as possible. I'm gonna consume more hatred. Power granted, unlock one relic slot. Oh, nice! We unlock a relic slot over there. Lost mana of two. Damn. I'm gonna go for the mana. You might want that relic slot, I think. 
I'm gonna be greedy and try to get the boar needle. Because I can get it right now. Carefully crafted earrings. Critical hit chance increased by 20%. Permanent hatred. On reveal, elites and bosses gain 5% increased health and damage. What do we mean permanent hatred? What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, those redeemed keys? Is that somebody getting a Spark Vault key? Nice. That's what that Humble Store purchase was. Yeah. Congrats to 8 Bit Noise for opening the Spark Vault. Does it carry over to another run? I know. That's what it sounds like. Maybe. Oh, well. I guess we choose the carefully crafted earrings. All right. I'm going to activate this poor bone needle. And now we're going to need a relic slot. If we want to get any more upgrades. All right. Season Pony is the first winner. Speak up in chat. Claim your prize. One hatred bar is full. So you will get one permanent hatred every time now. Every run. How do you reset that? Oh my goodness. Amateur Genius. Someone we met today has won the raffle. Congratulations, Amateur Genius. Once we pick all the winners, I'll tell you what you need to do. But you now have a Spark Vault key attached to your uh, account. And uh, you get to pick any game from the vault. Congrats. All right, let's go kill a boss. Yeah, let's go find him. And Bay! Bay, you have won! Congratulations, another newcomer. Welcome to the stream, gang. What a perfect way to uh, herald in some new folks. Having them win some uh, prizes. All right, so this is what I flew into and died. Four. Um, okay. You've been enjoying the stream, Bay? I'm glad. I'm really glad. How do I get in here? How do I get in here safely? Oh, like this. Uh-oh. Music immediately changed. Strange Shay is the next winner. Congrats. Congratulations. All right. These things look nasty. Before I go in here, let me just open the door to the garage because this cat, you guys can't see it, but he's nonstop pawing my legs. Are they highlighted in red because they're filled with hatred? I don't know. I think so. I think so. Strange Shay, are you here? Painting Strange Shay. Strange Shay, you have won a raffle. Please speak up in chat. Strange Shay, come to the courtesy desk. Oh, there's what the permanent is. You're right. It, oh, so we're going to get a hatred every single time. We activate relics. So that, so what that mechanic is there so that you can't just constantly run around to small little camps and collect every upgrade possible before going and doing like a dungeon or a challenge and just like overpowering stuff. Since it's an open world roguelite, that would be what your temptation would be to do. I'm just going to keep running into these small little camps forever and get all these upgrades and go, you know, beef mode. So eventually you're going to fill up these hatred meters and it's going to, you're going to make the enemies more and more powerful. That's, that's pretty clever. All right, let's see what this does. Hi. Parlay? I request the parlay. Oh my God, that's a lot of people. I wish I had spells or a ranged attack or... Okay. 
Okay. Chill out, everybody. Woo! I do do a lot of damage now. I do do? I do. We are really slicing through them. Okay. So what does that do? All hateful gales collected. Make your way to the tomb of gales. Okay. Nice. This one. You just took some of my water? Yeah, so what was I supposed to do? I don't know. Oh, okay. I'll take some water. All right. Wait, a gale? Was that the main quest and we didn't even know it? Yeah, it was. It, I, I went to here on purpose. Yeah. It was main quest. Mercenary's armor. Carefully crafted earrings. Permanent hatred. Thank you. Thank you for the permanent hatred. All right, and I have no slots to activate this other stuff. Reinforce my armor. Uh, a new subscriber arrives. Thank you. It fills you with determination. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, my calculation is one more newer gifted sub to our next giveaway. Yeah. Hey, Joanna, what's up? Oh, congrats on the spark ball key, Joanna. All right, let's get the mana here. Even though I don't think that's going to matter much, right? Yeah. Andresina is the next winner. Congrats. Marauder, is that the last one? Let's... Let's pull one extra since we're already at four toward the next one. And that way we won't have to start a brand new raffle in just like a couple of minutes if we get another sub. Please. Yeah. So just pull one extra and that way we're all square. Yeah. There, Strange Shay. Hey, you got your key. You got it. Um... Woo! We got ourselves a new honor. Welcome to the swamp. There we go. Uh, Enray, thank you so much. That's what you said to call you, right, Enray? There we go. And there's Hay Plays. All right, so where do we have to go next? 1500 this way. Is it on the same island or is it off this island? It might, it might not even be on this island. So we got to find another Raven launch point. There's one over there. Is that the closest? Man, this place is beautiful. Oh yeah, explain what to do. Uh, for those of you who have won a raffle and haven't won one before, um, type exclamation point vault or somebody can do it for you. And there's going to be a link that comes up. Click that link that Marauder just put in the chat. Um, choose any game from that vault. Um, actually choose two or three games from the vault. And just so there's an order, like what's your first choice, your second choice, and your third choice. You're going to do that because there's multiple winners. And in case somebody chooses the game that you wanted, I'll go down the list. You're going to send me a message on discord or email me. Follow the instructions at the top of the vault. It should give you my Discord, and it'll give you my email. Um, and uh, if a game is in the vault, I'll send it to you tonight. And that's it. Can you choose Ravenbound? Unfortunately not, no. Only what's listed in the in the vault. Yeah, these are all games that are donated by our community. Um, they're usually from, like, Humble Choice, Humble Monthly, uh, or games bought on the Humble Store. So uh, they're all legit keys. Um... 
and uh, we just have this trove of uh, games we try to find new homes for uh, through our uh, through our giveaways. Yeah. So if you have any questions, let a let a mod know, and uh, we'll help you out. Yeah. You're enjoying the ones you got recently, Cuddly Shark. That makes me happy. It's like the land of misfit toys, but it's the land of misfit games. We try to find. We try to relocate them to places where people will play them. Um. All right, let me go concentrate a little bit on the game here and uh, find a place to go. <laughs> oh, this bad guy's over here. Hey, Woob! Oh, man, I saw this stream on the front page. Thought the game was out. Damn, still excited to see more of it. Yeah, I, this is my first day playing it. It's it's wild. It's really cool so far. Yeah, it's still beta. This is still the beta. And, uh, yeah, the, the devs have sponsored this stream. They want me to, uh, they want to wish, they want folks to wish list the game. So click that link, Ape at Noise, put it in the chat. And uh, wish list it so that you'll get more attention to these devs. They deserve it. All right, let's see if we can fight these guys off. Such a very satisfying sound effect and effect when you bring up your shield at the last second. And it kicks their butt. Clear a hard camp without taking damage. Nice. Sweet. We really need the ability to unlock a new relic slot. Rommer's Essence Drainer. Your critical hits against a bleeding enemy consumes bleeding and deals 300% increased damage. Holy moly. Guard health increased by 100%. Jesus Christmas. Let's grab that. Avalanche, uh, Trevor says, if you use Raven Vision, D-pad right, you'll be able to see some nearby Raven Towers. Oh. Oh, look at that. That is very handy. Thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right, let's cons try consume more hatred. Why not? Lost mana. Increase the armor if you're currently. Uh, let's get more mana, I guess. And all this other stuff, I'm not gonna be able to use because I don't have a slot, right? We're up to six. All right, we don't have a, a slot for that. Are all of these relic slots? Now this, this, if we get eight, we can actually put that in and that doesn't even require relic slots. That's just an upgrade on our equipment. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, so it looks like our nearest launch point is up this way. Here we go. Are there more types of weapons that are yet to be discovered? I assume so. Yeah, because there's axes. There was like uh, in the in this after we died, there was a screen to unlock like longsword master, axe master, etc. This is the only one I had unlocked was sword and board master. Yeah. All right. So let's see where this can take us. Yeah. Amateur genius, uh, send me follow the instructions at the top of the uh, the game vault list, please. Send me a message on Discord or email me, and I'll respond tonight. I give away all those games manually. 
so I can't do that right now. So I do it. I do it in the evening. Is this where we need to go? Be careful. The hatred flows out of these halls like poison. So is this the start up here? Uh, no! <laughs> I wanted to go in. Yeah, they gave Strange Shea a key. No, there's no falling damage. But I wanted to go in there. I guess we'll have to grapple up. Okay. Okay. You guys see a way in? Hmm. He did not skip leg day, I guess. No. Is it a puzzle? I'm not sure. I've never been here. Be careful. The hatred flows out of these halls like poison. Maybe at the bottom of the mountain. Yeah, it might be. That's a little bit of... Uh... When you have access to a raven form where you can fly everywhere, you don't know exactly where you're supposed to come from. <laughs> and it's probably hard for the devs to uh, design it too. Like, which way are they going to approach this place from? Are there other characters you can play other than the deer? It looks like... Um... So I have human unlocked. There's a third... Uh... They call them folk. There's a third folk you can unlock. It looked like a, um, like a wolf man. Yeah. 99% of the people would have done the same. I would think so too. There is a way I can fly again over here. And then maybe we can take a, another look around. Oops. I've evolved into a mountain goat, I have. Well, I like that you can climb pretty easily. Maybe this is the way. <laughs> hey, wait, look! <laughs> I think this might be it. <laughs> uh... Alright, it's an open world roguelite. Yeah. Alright, the Tomb of Gales is open. This is the first dungeon. This is the first dungeon. Alright. Alright, so don't fly right to the top. Got it. Hey, Joe. Oh no! It's my kindred. And a human. Yeah, there's the dog. The wolf kind. Thanks, Trevor. Focus up. I know, now it's going to get hard. I think our build is pretty sweet so far. Hmm. 
and we'll see. Hello, Poppet! Hatred's Tempest Blade, okay. You're a zippy little guy, aren't you? Ooh. Uh-oh. You broke my bubble! You broke my bubble! No! No grappling? Oh, man. My bubble is down again. My God. Damn. Okay, we got him to 75. Jesus Christmas. That was hard. Yeah, when the bubble popped, that was tough. Can you heal? No. No, but you do have a shield that regenerates and uh, the dodging. Yeah. And uh, I had used the the shield so often during just running around the open world that I completely forgot where the dodge was. And then I hit every other button besides, I forgot it was on left trigger. Yeah. <laughs> that boss is really so fast. Yeah, he is. All right. Okay. Let's see what we unlock. Yeah. Visit the village of Valhus. We got 50 things. Die once. We got some other thing. Clear out 50 camps. We cleared eight. Okay, twin axe specialist is unlocked. Whenever drawing a weapon card from the deck, it is a twin axe weapon card. Okay. So here's what we unlock. Similar. When you drain a card, you gain one mana. What is draining a card exactly? So here we go. The sword and shield specialist. There's great axes, great weapons, twin swords, dual wielders, twin axes. Armor increased by 10. Yeah, I don't have enough to unlock any of these. Drain is when you replace a card. I don't know if I've done that. Yeah. You like the card system for building your character? Me too. You were wondering if there was a way to burn your extra cards? Oh, that would have been interesting. Because I would have gotten more mana for doing that. When you drain a card, gain one mana. All right, well, we're learning. We're learning. Let's play again. All right, so here we go. We got... Three humans this time. And I don't want to spend vessel. I don't want to spend money on re-rolling. <clears throat> uh, they're all sword and shield specialists. Tier of hatred determines the size and difficulty of enemy groups and the power of elites and bosses. All right, tier one is still the only one I can do. Yeah. Hold X to drain a card, Sammy? Okay. Didn't it say you can claim the Twin Axe Challenge? I, I Yeah, I don't know exactly how to unlock that. It just still showed me as having to unlock it. Yeah. A kind gesture. Thank you so much for using my Humble Store. Humble Store purchase made for $69.99. Thank you. Is that a Spark Vault key redemption? The things you unlocked, you had to press the B button to claim them? Oh! Can I claim them here? Oh, here we go. Hey, 
Thank you. Oh, look at this. We got this armor. So these will show up in our future runs now, right? Is that claiming them? It didn't make a like a noise when I claimed it. No. <laughs> How come it's not claiming? Oh, Dublinari, congrats on the game. Yeah, maybe I'll just click it. So I'll click it. Enter. And like this isn't going up. It actually blinks, but it doesn't go up. Might not be able to do it while you're in a run. I, I canceled the run though. Might only work when you just come out of a run. Should I just like run and die? Oh, is that what I did? I saved the run and went to the main menu. Let's just go die. Stay on target. I'm so sorry for doing this. Oh, you could test the drowning. You're right. Oh, they, they just they spawned you back. Hi, everybody. What's well, shaking? Ow. Why you do that? Ow, ow! I just was coming over asking for a cup of milk. Jesus! Jesus Christmas! Ow! Please! <laughs> the raven flew out of my body. We did really good. Okay. Zero! You get nothing! Good day, sir! Can I get the reward, please? It's so odd. Oh, back. Claim. Hey, there we go. Twin Axe Specialist. I just needed to hit it a zillion times. And then let's get these other things here. Okay, that'll be great if we can find that in our next run. Reflecting armor. Beautiful. Okay. Now we can do it. Oh, they didn't give us the new, uh, they didn't give us the new weapon option. Damn. Damn. You can re-roll, but I don't I don't think it's worth re-rolling. Alright, when you drain a card, gain mana. Let's do that. Oh I got the wait, did I re-roll? I I freaking re-rolled again. I'm gonna use the mouse and keyboard for this, but now we get the axe specialist. See, I did that so we could see a new weapon. My God. Using the PlayStation control is confusing me with the buttons. I oh, know, the hazards. <laughs> I have a, an Xbox uh, Elite controller, um, but, but my triggers, my, my bumpers are like the springs wore out on them. So I've been using my PS5 controller, which I'm really used to now, so. But at least we get to try a new weapon now. And it's only beta. Oh, 
All right. So we shouldn't go right to the dungeon, even though I'm tempted. Going right to the dungeon is probably suicide. You're worried for the day your Elite controller wears out. It's comfy but pricey to wear out like that. That's why I've, I've been... I have three PS5 controllers. They won't all wear out. <laughs> and even if I do, $70 is a lot... A lot uh, easier pill to swallow than... 200 you know or 150 or whatever it is all right let's clear out some camps here and then we'll go to that town do 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 hello Oh man, I like the twin axes. It's fast. I see you trying to stab me. Okay, that was nice. How many relics did they have? Just one? Or did they throw them in all kinds of awkward places? Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna get some mana. Three of them! Nice! That's a nice start. You love the dual axes? Yeah, those they seem pretty good. Yeah, and that's a good point. Like, why have that? Sh like, when everyone's got this shield, why does the sword? What, what does the shield do with the sword and board? I know, bog enjoying axes. What a shocker! I know. I always love axes in games. I missed. I like how this guy got his life completely obliterated while his friends watch. Woo! Spicy. You can block with the shield plus shield bash. They never taught me that, did they? I didn't see any of that. I thought in the tutorial they told them about block. I thought that this was block. Guard. Yeah, other than the bubble, I didn't see one. Let's, uh... Oh, there's the key. Hmm. Hi. Hello. Welcome home. How did you know I left? Do you have coffee? Oh. <laughs> In your hand. You remember I bashed during the tutorial, did I? I don't remember, though. I got that was, shark. That was so long ago. Sorry. Um, I'm gonna grab the key again, I guess. Why not the earrings? They look so cool. They're carefully crafted, in I fact. The little tiny axes. I have earrings that are like that. What do you think, gang? Should I get the key? Get the key. Or a crit hit 20%. Nah, get the key. I know that's what you want. You get the mouth of Sauron over there. I always get that. <laughs> that you get. That you get regardless. Should I get the crit? Yeah? All right. Fine. I'm gonna listen to you. Look, we've got 20% crit now. Which is pretty significant, honestly.
was probably a charged secondary attack. Could be. Yeah. The, the bash? Maybe. Lost mana again. Unlock one relic slot. Or riches. I'm going to grab the relic slot. I'll just activate that right away. So now we can get more bonuses. All right, let's go beef up our build and then go fight that boss. What the? No spells? Oh, no spells. No. I didn't anticipate wizards. Oh, they're kicking my ass. Um, I'm very sorry to have disturbed you. monies five monies okay clear out 50 camps all right we're gonna 10 none of these are done right back in all right two of these are our axe specialists oh the guy with the beard do it the raven has left the building those guys were no joke different side quest this time so i guess each of those things is a different dungeon you gotta do the main quest to unlock the dungeon first. Let's see what this is. Oh shit. You're fine. Let's rub some dirt on it. Whee. Whee. Boss before I stop. I'm gonna keep going. Sparkwood. Yeah, my sponsor segment was two hours, but we got a lot of people here. We'll keep playing. like to see more we barely scratched the surface of the first dungeon yeah you've seen bog otter wants to win the first boss I, yeah just a little bit just a little bit all right we got a bronze ear hook let's get the carefully crafted earrings which match my weapons we're going to get more hatred here. And we get some lost mana. Ooh, or the, or the relic slot. What do you think, gang? Get some early mana or the early unlock of the slot? Relic? Mr. Kingless? Mana? Mana? Slot. You feel like mana is more common than relic? That's not a bad bit of logic there. Yeah, let's get it. I 
All right. Oh, if you can line that up, you can just fly right in. Mess them up. Ah, get out of here. These guys are tough. And like we have no upgrades, so we're not we're doing like weak sauce damage. Oh. Every time she tries to stab me in the back, she gets punished. Hey, we got a challenge complete. All right, give me the fragment. Give me the fragment. There's the key. There's the thimble. Let's go for the thimble. And I can drain a card here if we don't want to use one, right? Let's drain. Oh wait, it's, I'm a human, so draining draining the card gives me gold, not mana. That sucks. Yeah. I prefer the guards to dodge attacking. I do. I am so not used to dodging with left trigger. Like I want I want dodge to be my my B button. I don't know if there's I don't think you can keybind change. Ooh, three mana. Grab that. It's beta, so I don't think you can rebind yet. I said I didn't see the option for that. All right, we got three mana. Let's grab. Twenty percent crit. And the thimble. And I, they said that you can swap the cards out, right? Can you swap the cards out once you place them in? What I love is like this is this is such a, like a different kind of concept game. Like I haven't played one like this before, and it's just fun experimenting and reading chat and seeing people speculate. This game's got a lot of uh, a lot going for it. You can probably spend mana to overwrite, but you don't get it back. Yeah, I think you're probably right, but we'll see. I'll try to dodge. Oh, you son of a biscuit. Plus, when you block uh, successfully, you get that little you get that little surge, like the free surge for a little bit. Sunken ship miniature. Oh, there's the boar needle again. Got to go for that. So now we need four mana. That was gonna be a cave. Right, cave of wonders. Is the yellow bar above their health stagger? I think so. You get something similar if you do a perfect dodge as well. Yeah, it's not the blue surge. It's something different. Holy crap! What is that? This is gonna be my death. I offer parlay. Oh. Oh god. Oh, and my shield is gone. 
Yeah, I got a little bit of a speed boost. Yeah, no way. Oh my god, are you crazy? Can I have this? Um, yeah, we need we need five needles. <laughs> okay, yeah, we'll go. I'm going. So you can retreat. We gotta get back to we gotta get to the town and spend our gold now. That's a camp. 192 meters this way. Yeah, that is a tough one. Where's my bow for kiting? I know, right? Let's find ourselves a nice little hamlet where we can heal. Alright. 80? Isn't that beating a dead horse? <laughs> What's up, Rex? How's it going? Thanks for the 80 months. Um, all right. Now, do I have any coins? No. How many coins do I get for burning a card? 50? That's enough for one heal, right? Let's drain it. Did that give me 50? Yeah, okay. It just didn't show up right away. Um, I need to heal. Anyone? Anyone got potions? Anyone at all? They have a quest. Hello. Again and again they come, thieves and murderers in the night. There is nothing we can do to stop those foul old loggy and their cursed souls, even as they bleed our village dry. If only there was someone who can help. I am someone! All right. I got a new quest. One that won't try to bite. No potions, but you have thoughts and prayers. Thank you. Thank you, Nick. All right, here we go. Give me the potion. Okay, so that's a decent heal. 132. All right, now we have to... Let's go do the quest. And then hopefully get some more money. So we can get some more healing, so we can do more quests. And so on, and so on. I definitely wasted money last time. Yeah, I think I've wasted one. Oh, yeah! Missed. Ooh. I didn't even see you there, and I hit you. Big bada boom. Wait, you're not dead? I like that we're fighting over hot coals. All right, there we go. Quest complete. Give me these fragments. Only two fragments? Oh well, we can take the hatred. Let the hate flow through us. I can get two lost mana. More money. 
Oh, damn. I think we need the mana, right? I do need the needle. Guard health. Stagger resistance? Or the guard health hook? I don't think that matters, because we're probably going to burn it for money. <laughs> um, yeah, we need to get to four mana. We're at two now. Thank you. Uh, question on health. I noticed that when you get kind of grayed out health after hitting, if you don't get hit again, do you get some of that back? Um, I don't know. I, I'm having... I, I, I'm not able to watch that as closely as you guys, so... Yeah. I'm trying not to die. Ideally, you just have to kill for fragments until you have the cards you want to go for. Chests for mana. Okay. You think there's like a Bloodborne mechanic where you gain it from hitting the enemy but not totally sure? Let's see. There is a... Isn't there like a Codex? Yeah. Um, surging will drain your focus, but give you a huge temporary damage increase. I don't know. Do you see something that would... Look at the damage number color when you do damage to an enemy while the gray section is still active in the health bar. <laughs> if you get if you get hit, a gray part of your health will go away. You have a few seconds to recover it by hitting the en enemy constantly until it's lost. Okay. Hello. Oh, I didn't want to get hit. Oh yeah, I see the gray now. Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, you're right. So you want to be aggressive when you, if you get hit. Okay, so we have the quest to turn in. I would like to stop at a uh, like an easy camp. Is there anybody who's easy around here? I'd like to get one more relic. Are you easy? Are you guys easy? What happened? How did I get hit there? I don't feel so easy. My sound effects are uh, throwing me off. There we go. All right. Oot lucky. Yeah. Oh, there's the thimble. Hey, we can get a second needle. Um. Hmm. I 
You get two mana right there. Okay. And now we're gonna grab the boar bone needle. 120% damage increase, which is super nice. Okay. Now we're cooking with Wesson. Now we need to get our health back. Easy like a Sunday morning. I like that. Try to take a bite of my lunch here. Oh, I can get cards. You're right. Another needle. We'll probably sell that. I can keep doing camps until we can get another one slotted in. And then go face the boss. Hmm. But we don't have armor. We don't have armor on this run either. You don't need armor if you don't get hit. You've been watching the stream long enough to know. You know. Oh, did I just run past this person? Fires in their camps that seem to have gone out, and I hope so has the red fire in their eyes. What causes them to haunt us so? I'm afraid we will never know. Thank you for your aid. What did you give me? Did they give me something? Did they give me treasure? 100 gold? 100 coins. Hey, lion, what's up? All right, let's, uh... Get a heal. Should I spend uh, another one to get the 40 health? This is just gambling over here, right? Oh, I can browse wares. Oh. Oh, damn. That costs zero mana. Oh. We need, we need to save up some gold. Wait, can I, um, I can get 50 gold for every card I burn. So that's a hundred. I can do a hundred. I can get up to 200, right? I can burn all the cards and get that Utlagi deterring armor. When taking damage from an Utlagi, armor increased by 100, and it also gives me 33. But then I get rid of the second needle. What do you think? Let's do this. Let's do another little camp or two. Let's do another camp. And see if we can get something. Or get the better axes. Were there better axes there? I didn't even see it. There's no mages there, right? I was looking for mages. <laughs> I'm afraid of mages now. <laughs> Oh, I missed. I 
I hate that little like front stab they do Because I don't I don't really see it I think my combat sounds are uh, a little weird right now It's a beta gang it's a beta That's better axes by only slightly though and I could get the art. Let's get the armor here. How good were the axes? There were two axe options. That armor condition seems restrictive. I wasn't looking at the armor as much from the actual power as much as I only have 10 armor right now. Yeah. They were fine axes. So maybe we get the armor here. How's the game bit uh, been Edon? It's it's great. It's it's a lot of fun. It's definitely my type of thing. Hey, you got a fine axe. I bet you say that to all the streamers. Lost riches. Ooh, there we go. Some mana. Give me the mana. Okay, so I could don the armor. I think we I think we try to save up to get another bone needle in there. I think that's what we do. What kind of camp is that? That looks like wizards, right? We want to no we want no part of that. Totally wizards. All right, where can I fly? Whee! Okay, there's the there's the wizards. We don't want that. Let's see. Can we go? What is this? <laughs> what do you see? You're going too slow. I mean, you're going too fast. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I guess it's on. One day I'll actually hit that. That stab! I hate that stab! You're the worst! Yeah, our combat uh, sounds are are borked right now. We're getting so much hatred. Four axes, that's all I can get. All right. So running around and doing camps, I think is pretty much over for us. Right, because we're, 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 we're making the elites get so much more powerful. There we go. There's the mana we need. Okay, mana. Let's fill our last relic slot with... The Bone Boar Needle. 120% more damage. That's our second one of those. All right. And then let's go back to the town, sell a few things, heal up. Get a new weapon. Maybe get armor, we'll see. And then go to the dungeon. How do you want them to attack instead of the stab? It's just, it's just that the, uh, the, tel the, the telegraph for that attack, that thrust, like when they, when they hack, when they, when they do a, like a, a slash, I actually can dodge it or block it. That little stab catches me off guard every time. All right, where's the where was the town? I don't know where the town is. 
without a quest marker, I lost it. Uh, little town. It's a quiet village. Every day. Like the one before. We don't need markers where we're going. Actually, I kind of want markers. Because I lost the town. Uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's one of the dungeons. Thank God there's no predators in the sky yet. Yeah, yet. Um, okay. Well, I lost where we need to go. There's no symbols on the for the towns, right? That I'm just missing. Why would you all say that? I know, right? We just get sw swooped up by a wyvern. Town was close to a raven point. Well, yeah, but there's tons of raven points. It was. There was a raven point in the town. Yeah, that quest. I completed that quest, though. So it doesn't show on the map anymore. It was around 1,400 away from the main quest. Okay, so let's get closer to the main quest. Wasn't the town too close to the dungeon? Yeah, I don't know. Let's go. Go closer and we'll see. Sorry, gang. I feel like the little villages should be marked. Oh, here we go. Over here? Maybe it is marked. I just wasn't looking the right... Yeah, they are marked! See? They totally thought of that. got this. Hi. Browse wares. All right, we have 50 coins. Um So they have fine axes for 90. Those get our damage up to 13. And we have They're 43. Oh, I can pick a card. You're right. You're right. Should I pick a card though? Yeah, 13 doesn't sound high. Yeah, we just made it stronger. We made it stronger. We just made it 10% stronger. My axes are at 30 something. Yeah. So why don't we burn cards? Let's burn cards so that we get the armor. Is it because of the buffs though? Yeah, that's a good question. Those axes are not very fine at all. These okay, so no, these are twin axes. They're 10. Alright, that's that's the issue. The ba they're base 10, so these are actually base 13. So they're three steps above, which still is not amazing. Still not amazing, but. All right, let's, uh, let's drain this card. 
We get... <laughs> it took away my gold when I drained it. It's like, what? So I might as well just use these axes. If I can get the mana for it. Let's get rid of the key. Um... I can't get that. Hey, you're going to lurk mode now and dive into Ravenmount beta testing? Great. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Congrats on your uh, your game vault win. Send me a message uh, and I'll send you your game later tonight. Um, How much money do I got now? I have 200. So what's your, what's your, what's your theory, gang? Should I grab the armor? Grab the armor, right? Getting three more damage boosted by all the mollifiers would be quite a big increase. You think so? All right, let's do this. Let's grab this, buy the card. Okay. We're learning. We'll do, we're, uh, we'll figure this out together. This doesn't cost any mana, so we can just go right into it. Boom. And then let's burn this card, because we don't need it. And we'll burn this card. Okay, we're at 36 attack, right? And let's buy the fine axes. Okay. And... Goes up to 47. Nice. And look at us! What? That is a nice helmet right there. <laughs> did I do the quest? Uh, I did the side quest. I didn't do the main quest yet. We have to do the main quest. Do I have enough money for a heal? No. Is the thimble 20%? Yeah. Oh yeah, I have a thimble and two and two boars. You're right. I need to heal though. That's the issue. Isn't this the quest to open the dungeon first? Don't we have to do that first? Yeah, we have to go into the scar here. A scar. Depends on the scale is. If it maxes at 20, a three level raise is huge, yeah. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Maybe I'll get money. That's true. And maybe we'll just die and all this was for nothing. Why would you say that? I don't know. I wish the sound was working on the on the weapon swings. All right. Whew. 
make your way to the Tomb of Gales. Okay. Dungeon is open. We didn't lose too much health. Collect two fragments. I guess I should activate it. Should I activate this? Maybe they'll give me gold. I don't know. Shield charm. Hey, let's get another boar, boar bone needle. I can sell one of these for gold. You need to restart the game to get the audio back. That's a bug. Yeah. A third needle. I know. Can I, I can exit and then we'll save the run. It will, 100%. I did earlier, I know, but I'm, I'm nervous now that I haven't invested in this. It will save, okay. So exit to main menu. Prefer axes to sword and shield. This is really like my first full run with the axes. Uh, they attack quicker. Yeah, I kind of like them better. Um, I wonder if I have to escape all the way out. Let's try. There's the sound coming back. Okay. Where's my armor? My armor is there. No, there it is. Is the sound back? Yeah, I think so. I just don't look the same. I have a second perma hatred. Yeah, I think I was close to that anyway, right? I guess I don't get to look cool anymore now. But my stats are still there. That's what's important. I think the I think the sound isn't there. Maybe I should just restart. Should I start the whole game over? Let's do that. Let's do that. All right. And gang, uh, this is a good point to mention that thanks so much to uh, the devs systemic uh, reaction for sponsoring today's stream. Um, wishlist this game. It's it's freaking awesome. This game is going to be so much fun when it comes out. Um, we don't have any information about the release dates and such yet. Uh, oh, unsaved game may be lost. Don't do that. Um, send. So yeah, wishlist this on Steam. If you use that link that Rosewolf just put in the chat, it'll tell uh, the devs that they wishlisted through Bog Otter's link. Help me out. Help me get opportunities like this in the future. It's been a pleasure to uh, show off this game to you today. Um, and I'm so glad we met so many new people. Yeah. Wishlist the game. It's free. The wishing part, not the price tag. Yeah. I think it, I think they said it's $29.99 was the price. I mean, things can change. But that's what I was told. Um, which seems like a great price for this. In ages long forgotten. All right, let's see. Well, we have sound. It's good to know that you can start. Hey, hey look, we got sound and our fancy look. Nice. All right, cool. Back. Back, baby. Does it tell you anywhere how many people wishlisted your link? I have a lot of you folks as friends on Steam, so I can get a little uh, indication from that way. But it's, uh, it's a tracking link that the sponsor will be able to check. Yeah.
President Eka says, in ages long forgotten. In ages long forgotten, nobody remembers what happened. The end. That's good enough. That was good enough. Yeah. Uh, Kingless says, uh, have you ever heard of Crown Sworn? Sorry if this already asked. Work pulled me away every time I asked, so fingers crossed. Uh, no. I have not heard of Crown Sworn, I don't believe. What is that? And you think we have a card to burn for coins? We do. We do. I just got to get back to, uh... I got to find the town again. I love Hollow Knight. Absolutely love Hollow Knight. So this is a... You're talk, talking about a Hollow Knight type game? Crown Sworn. I'll take a look at it later. Thanks. By the way, if you like, um... If you like Hollow Knight and you're waiting for Silk Song, um, I played a game a couple years ago on stream called Ender Lilies at the request of Sparkwood, and uh, it was amazing, very Hollow Knight-ish. So if you're looking for another Metroidvania like that, all right. So where was that town again? Yeah, Ender Lilies. It's 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 really good. It's really good. Same kind of vibe. But I will definitely check out Crown Sworn. All right, wasn't it close to? Wow, look at that place. Some evil monster there. I can't wait to get powerful enough so I can tackle all this stuff. It was about fourteen hundred ish. So go to 1400-ish and then fly in a circle around it. Oh, here it is. It's up on the hill. <clears throat> All right, so we're going to heal up. Wow, my voice is going. Heal up and then go to the dungeon. Talk. Purchase. Oh, I don't have the money. Sorry. I need to burn this card. I like how um, burning cards really affects, or like which race you choose, really is going to affect how the game plays. You know, if you're uh, if you're one of the stag people. Burning cards gives you mana, so you can equip more, like, uh, more, like, passive items and stuff. And the humans can just go and heal like that. Yeah. You want to know what the wolf homies get? Yeah, I don't know. We haven't played that yet. Almost full health. Okay. All right, so here's the mountain. Here's the first dungeon. This is gonna be so anticlimactic if I just go in here and get my ass kicked like right away. <laughs> I feel like that's what's gonna happen. Oh, you scared me! My son is trying to get in the door. Hold on. Thanks, Combat Sky. Thanks, Trevor. Here we go. Attempt number two. Thanks, Cuddly Shark. Thanks for the bits. <laughs> Hold dodge, then press attack. That's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, 
Oh man. He's kicking my butt already. My goodness. He just does so much damage. So hard. Oh my God. So what? What throws me off, what throws me off is the, when I lock on, like the camera doesn't keep it, him on the screen in front of me. And it throws me off. It's not like, um, it's not like combat in similar type, like third person games that way. And I think that's really, so I'm dodging and I expect like the camera to kind of stay. I don't know how to describe it. But that's really what's throwing me off while well, I'm getting my my butt kicked. <laughs> yeah, the lock on the when I'm locking on, it's not keeping it locked. Yeah. All right. Well, that's that was disappointing. What I feel like I need to do is just go right to the boss now and practice a little bit. All right. Let's see what we unlocked. Um. Critical damage increased by hundred percent. Assassin's hairpin. That's pretty cool. Okay, we can unlock that for future runs. I like that. The, the whole unlocking the cards for future runs and then you get new things, really well done. I like all of that. Your critical hits temporarily grant 50% luck. I don't know what luck does. That sounds interesting though. Do we have enough to buy a trait? No, we only have 67 thingies. Parrier. -er. You can parry and parry -er. All right, here's our next victims. I mean, heroes. Heroes! One sword and shield. Two axes. What do you think? Should we go axes again? Never drawing a weapon card from the deck, it is a sword and shield. Yeah, the lock was not really a lock on. Hopefully something they change. Yeah. Well, that's beta. They can fix things and add things and change things. Yeah. Lock on and don't touch the stick. It will track. Try it on bandits first. Okay. Regar regardless, um, the lock on is not what I'm used to. I'm not trying, we're trying to get used to the dodge. Hi, what's going on? Hi, I'm sorry to bother you, but um, the Steam Deck won't turn on. Hershey wants to play Rogue Legacy on the TV. I want to turn on. Is it charged? Would it not be charged? If it was unplugged, it will lose its charge. Oh! <laughs> nice, nice sound. Thanks. <laughs> So, I've spent all the time playing today beating up these enemy camps using the uh, the shield bubble, which is w way not good on that boss. So I gotta get used to... I don't know how to do this. Oh. 
I thought she was dead. Okay. Steam Deck. Yeah, the Steam Deck. Alright. Consume Hatred. Open this up. Ooh, nice. Three mana. Right off the bat. Having to recode my brain to think Dark Souls power equals Ravenbound dodge. Yeah, that's... If you... In order to time out perfect dodges... Yeah, 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 yeah. You just leave yours plugged in all the time now. My only disappointment. That's, that's what I do as well. I leave my Steam Deck plugged in all the time. I don't know why it was unplugged. Hey, Flying Bat Block. Thanks for following. Welcome to the stream. Okay, so... You think you unplugged it when you had COVID? I was going to use it and never did. Ah, okay, gotcha. That makes sense. Funny, like against these guys, it's just so much easier to, to block. But that whole strategy goes out the window against the boss. Because he does like a. I, I don't know if it's two swings or I mean, I don't know if it's three swings or four swings But he completely takes away your shield By the end Yeah What day will you be able to pre-order the game? They haven't announced anything about uh, pre-orders or when the release might be yet. No, yeah, they don't know yet. I did the dodge attack probably completely on accident. I, I another another um, another thing I could do is there have been some cards that increase the shield block. I could stack those cards so that my bubble is much bigger. Yeah, we can try that. When you take damage from an Utagi. Um, that armor is pretty good. Let's take that. Oh, I didn't even realize I was collecting a, uh, I can't carry any more fragments. Oh, we need to do another. Health increase by 30. That's interesting. All right, so we can do... We can do the armor. And the health. Oh, and the hook. We have the hook, too. I already have it. the armor of currently equipped oh nice we got more mana oh masterfully sharpened blade increases the original base damage of currently equipped weapon to 30 percent i replaced the armor though what did Um, 
Yeah, look at my armor. Oh, when I equipped the health, oh, the health got rid of that. Oh, I didn't realize it was armor. I thought it was a relic slot. My bad. Oh, that was dumb. That was dumb. And is this, is this one of these slots over here? Or does it instantly take effect on the weapon? Like I have to make sure I have the right weapon before I activate this. Yeah, we know for next time. I, everything, you know what? This is what playing a game is all about. You're gonna make tons of mistakes and learn as you go. And you know what? Since we're doing this together as a stream, you guys can learn from my mistakes. Only on the weapon, Meadow? You would think it's a relic? I don't know. I don't know if that's the case. Okay, so that's a little bit harder to use because I would want to buy. I would want to buy a better weapon or get a better weapon and then use it, you know? Stewberry says, whoa, how did you get a different weapon other than sword and shield? So there was one of the achievements I got. When I died and went back to the main lobby, it unlocked twin axes. I had to collect the reward. Make sure you collect the reward if you've done any of those achievements. And then there's a possibility when you roll a new character that some of them will have sword and board and some of them will have twin axes. Yeah. I forget which achievement it was, though. I impressed them, I think. They seem impressed. I'm actually pretty low health here. Thanks for following. I hope that helps you. Let's see what we get. There's the bone bore needle. I don't know if we're going to get the mana for it. So much hatred already. Coins. Relic slot. Reinforced armor. I'm gonna get the coins, I guess. <laughs> so much for going right for the boss, right? Now I've got all the stuff I need to do. The border needle plus the sharpened blade. I know, but I need all of the... Uh, I need all. I need tons of mana now. Oh, this lore over here I haven't gotten. I need that. Anytime you see the lore, pick these up because they give you the currency to unlock stuff. Oh, this is not lore. I thought you were lore. You're not lore. Purchase reliquary coin. This is okay. So that's how you hold stuff over for future runs. I think. Sorry, meant diamonds. They happen when played equipment or like pentagons or something. Are you talking about like the shapes of the cards? Oh, okay. The diamonds. They happen when played equipment or like pentagons. Ah, uh, so it's different shapes. Circles are the uh, the relics, the passives. Oh, this is going to give us mana. We need this. I did a murder.
Ooh, I took a hit there. What? Ah, oh, that one was hard. Victorellis, thanks so much for hanging out with us today. Uh, it was good meeting you. Hopefully see you on another stream. Yeah. Um. There's that guard health again. Give me the mana. Three. Thank you. We needed that. We've got no coins. Making a gross noise. Uh. Is lore marked by Raven Vision? I don't know. That would be cool. Should I just get the sharpened blade on my on my on my base weapon though? See, I don't think I should do that on my base weapon. The slots the cards go in also light up when you're hovering over it. You are absolutely right. So you know if it's an item or not, and this is not. So yeah, so this is going to just cover my base weapon. I See, I already got invested in this character's build, and I shouldn't have. I should have just go right for the boss. And practice, because... I think the first boss is just going to take a while. Unlock new things. Level up your account. You know, understand the mechanics. I like how this game is structured. I really do. I know, I got too emotionally invested too fast. I'm like, ooh, I can do this and this and this and this with this build. <laughs> I'm gonna go do a side quest so I have enough money so I can do this so I can do that Hi. So I guess the most reliable way to get money Is really do that side quest for a hundred and I can also I can burn cards to heal I could spend So I can burn a card for 50 or spend a mana for 75. So that's re this really, I should just drain it. Right? If I burn it, I get 50. If I spend the mana, I get 75. And burning it doesn't cost any mana. Burn a hook? Yeah, we probably don't need two hooks. All right, let's burn two hooks. Burn one hook. I gotta get, I gotta get a healing. Okay. Otherwise, we can't survive. And should we do the, should we do the mini quest? Oh, I'm so, so sorry about your pottery. Actually, does your pottery in town here give me any money? No. We need money. Money, money, money. Who who has the quest this time? Somebody up here. Hello. Hello. Red eyes in the night. I wonder if there are things you can break in town to get money.
because of Zelda, you break all the pots again. I know, right? Okay. Somebody remember where this town is. I have arrived. <laughs> what was that? trying to use the dodge but the, every time i start relying on dodge i get killed okay. fragments for me you shouldn't have we got a weathered utlagi banner i guess that was what we needed to get from the quest the town in the game. Can I try to buy with the NPC you say holds an item next run? So we can see what it does. Oh, look at this. Then I lose the health. And get that armor back. We can always sell it if we decide not to get it. Ooh. Okay, thank you for the mana. We need mana so bad. both guard cards and practice the boss I, I sold one of the guard cards <laughs> didn't I sell one already I think I did um yeah we gotta go practice the boss though you're right I went right back into my old habits maximize damage All right, let's go get our gold. With our gold, we get a new weapon. Then we sharpen the weapon. Whee! All right, give me gold. Done coins fine twin axes for 90 grab that Okay. Equip them. Sharpen them. All right, and now we need one more mana to use the needle. This is not as good as the one we have in our inventory, is it? No. 43 to 33, but it's free. It doesn't take mana. 
Oh, look at the weapons. They actually look different, right? They look shinier. All right, let's go do the main quest and see how much damage we take trying to open up the scar. This game's super addicting. Like, I don't want to stop it ever. Never, ever. There's a scar. Can I just go right into the scar? See, the last time I tried that, it... I broke the game, so I don't want to do that. <gasps> okay, I didn't break the game. Okay, good. Hi, guys! I like how he waited. <laughs> okay. Did I take much damage? I don't think I took much. Just a little bit. I'm gonna get double hatred here. Give me mana. I need mana. No mana. Shadow at noon. You're glad the Apex Connect ID is just isn't me. That's uh, it's a watermark to protect their beta, right? If people start posting footage, they can track down who it is and revoke it. Yeah. Game looks pretty good. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Mana, yes. Did I always get tre two treasures here? Did I, I might have left treasures here in the past. Unlock one relic slot and two more mana. Let's just go crazy with the mana. We are crazy with that mana. Okay, we're gonna watch our watch our weapon goes from 17 up to 33 My guard health goes up by a hundred I think I missed one in the past I think so too Are we still trying to kill the first boss? Yes I do use guard a lot. Let's try it. I could do this too. The armor goes up by eight. Let's see. Let's see if we we pick up another one of those at some point. Do we? If, do we get one more mana somehow before we go? Nah. Let's just go. Because the more the more I try to get more mana, the more powerful the enemies are gonna get. Is that the closest one? Should I try to heal up? How much money we got? Ten. I can get rid of the shield charm and heal. It's gotta be a closer one, right?
What's in here? Oh, no. Oh, hi. Are your parents home? Oh, no. Oh no! <laughs> I'll go flying. Yes! I got an achievement. Ooh. What kind of fragment is that? That's a different kind of fragment altogether. Strap of the Inspired? <sighs> when you surge, consume 10% of your coins. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I remember that one. Focus gain increased by 30%. Interesting. It's like a Goblin Warren, you know? Yeah, looks like if you can attack fast enough, you don't get hit too hard. That's right. I still hear more goblins now. Ah, so this is like some... This is cool as hell. You just said dada. I wish I could find a lot of gold in here, you know? Gold? Any gold? The flashing is kind of odd. Oh, there is, there's something up here. First, I thought it was like lightning. And then I realize I'm in a cave. Just a lot of lightning hitting inside. Yes. Uh, a free relic slot. More coins or reinforced armor. Really need mana. Maybe I shouldn't have played that and I could I could have chosen to sell that at some point. All right, let's see where this goes. I wonder if there's like a goblin mini boss. Or is this the way I came in? That's the way I came in. So up there is the treasure. Uh, Seth, you're playing Returnal right now, and this game gives you the same feeling. You know what? There is a similar vibe to that in terms of how the runs work. Yeah. The roguelite elements. Yeah, this is all... This cave is... The lighting in this cave is a little, uh, wonky. 
All right, so that's everything in there. Flashing lights not good. Yeah, it's just hopefully when we leave the cave, it stops. There we go. That's better. You feel like the deer class would be the most popular play? Yeah, because when, when getting mana starved is no fun. You know, you want to use your stuff and you don't have the mana for it. Um, but I will say, being a human, I always know I can go back to a town and just burn one card and I can I can buy a healing potion. You know? Oh, the weird sense thing was on that whole time? I didn't even realize. I could have helped, Meadow. I didn't even realize. I thought it was like nighttime. <laughs> it's nighttime! Let's go to town and heal up. I don't remember where the town was now. Again. So this quest... We did the quest to open the door, yeah? There's... there's that's where we need to go. So the town is... Over this way? Have we lived long enough to see nighttime yet? I don't even know if there's day and night cycles. Are there? Other way? Towards the quest and then continue past, you sure? Okay. Having a compass at the top to know which direction you're going would help. Raven's Eye reveal uh, the town too? Like any differently? I see it over here. Yeah. I don't know if that actually points that out. Whee! Alright, we made it. Just that. Um, nothing else we need to buy, right? Unless we were going to buy this armor. I don't think I can afford it. Nope. You saw that on another channel? Someone from Avalanche Studio mentioned it. Oh, yeah? Okay. Cool. Thank you. Thanks for the tip. All right. Let's fly to the uh, the boss. Let's try it again. And I can use... I think I have one more mana to use. I'm going to not farm anything else because the corruption will just keep the hatred will keep adding to the boss's damage. I keep going in there like <laughs> majorly buffing the boss. Whee! What's the other thing I could do? I could do armor increase by eight. 
Yeah, if we're going in, might as well, right? There we go. This is the one? All right, Trevor. The last 10 times we just practiced. This is only our third attempt. So what is make your way to Svali zero of three blessings? What is that? Are there blessings I should be getting before going down here? <laughs> to make this easier? <laughs> Where are the blessings? I need a blessing. It must be so hard as a game studio to watch people play your game and want to like tell them everything and have to just sit there and be like, nope, you got to play our game. <laughs> got to keep my mouth shut. All right. I'm nervous. my health back. How did you tag me? No, you don't. Uh-oh. Phase two? Get away! Okay. You're more powerful now? Is that what that means? you attack in a row oh that move is so different the one extra move it gets at 50 percent such a different uh attack pattern that was close Whew. damn hey systemic welcome back how many head pats do you owe the devs tons gang everybody go wishlist this game hashtag game or type exclamation point ravenbound click the link Wishlist the game. All right, that was much better. That was much better. I feel like we can get it. But damn. Damn, damn, damn. You call this boss a dance contest. It is. We are having a dance off. We were. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of it. Definitely have to rely on the dodging. Will this game be releasing this year? We don't know, Stove. We don't have uh, any definitive answer for that. Oh, the sharpened axes. Look at those. Those are nice. What I need to do is stop buffing the boss before you go down there by looting so much, but then I wouldn't do as much damage. 
Should we try like a naked run? Like just go right there? I wonder how that would work. Good night, Trevor. Thanks again for hanging out with us and watching. Yeah, I know, but loot, but loot. Should I go back to Sword and Shield? Yeah, Valley Duff, it's it's a lot of fun. You still get the damage boost from perfect dodge and guard, yeah. Should I go to the deer for mana? Yeah, but if we're going right for the boss, does it matter? Um, let me take a really quick AFK before this run. What's going on? Bellstar, you're enjoying this as well. Excited to show my husband when he gets home. Seems like the kind of game he'll take turns with while the other handles the kids. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's like, all right, you do a run until you die, and then I'll do a run until you die. Exactly. All right. Um, We're going to try and... Go right toward the boss. And get some more practice and see what we can do without like spending a lot of time upgrading and making the boss stronger in the process. All right, Mad Monkey TV, thanks for following. Unfortunately, I can't go much later tonight. Um, I usually end my stream around four, so we have about 20 minutes left. I uh, can't go super long, but. Um, this has been a lot of fun. Hi. Hey guys. Leave me alone, please. I would rather not have to get a potion. <laughs> a lot of dancing going on. Oh. One fragment, collect two fragments. Treasure. It went pretty smoothly, I agree. All right, let's take the mana, just in case we get something in this other chest. Wait, no, it's not always two chests. Interesting, it's not always two chests. Well, now that we have two mana, maybe we should take out like one camp before we try the boss. Just just so we have stuff, you know, to use the mana on since we have mana already. You know? Maybe. Yeah, look, it's right here. There's just one right here. Sure, it's okay. Oh, hi. Of course, these are elites. Air. 
There we go. See, that worked out nicely. See, we can get we can get upgraded armor right away. Um stagger resistance, that'd be good. Let's just grab the armor. What do you get here? So we're gonna get two more mana right here. Um, I guess we are. Actually, I should have gotten a different card that cost one and then burned one card. So I should have done. Yeah, guess we'll have to do another. <laughs> um, all right, grab this. Put the armor on. Cool. How easy is it to climb up there? You can totally loot some until you get close to the first bar. Yeah, but a lot of the a lot of the camps, the treasure gives you some hatred. Like we're, I, I don't think we've done any hatred upgrades to the bosses right now, right? This game tries to trick you and to keep looting. It does. One hundred percent. And the problem is, what, what's going to happen is I'm going to go for the next thing and I'm going to take damage. And then I'm going to like, well, now I need to go heal. <laughs> um, so where's the main quest? Loot areas that you cleared the hatred of close to the rift. Wait, so how does that whole mechanic work? I don't understand the... Oh. So the camps that I cleared the hatred out of, they don't have camp. The treasure won't have that? I didn't know that. Hold on. Does this one have no... No, uh... Camp has no hatred. No, it's just a. This is a mana treasure. I totally didn't even know about that. Can you check it with your Raven Vision? And I don't know. See, here we're several hours in, and we're still learning the basics. Ooh, see, now we're gonna need to heal. See what you did, Kelly Shark? This is all your fault. Don't block me. earrings hmm you want a ch bigger chance to stagger the boss I guess it's gonna be more mana three more mana Look at this. This run, we've got more mana than what we can do with. I 
don't like that those chests whisper. Zap, 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 zap. Ah, <laughs> oh, thought I was going to get it for once. me down okay so that's really the strategy you gotta do camps you gotta destroy a rift and do the camps around the rift so you don't constantly up the power of things i was not doing that at all my other runs <laughs> i didn't know how that worked at all okay um eh, these aren't that great they didn't really give me great things here Increase the armor of currently equipped armor by three. We already got 43 on that. I guess we'll sharpen our blade. Something like that. All right, let's go. Let's go. Um, I don't have money to heal. This is how they get you. You know? Because now I want to heal. The next loot will be the plus 5 render. I know, right? And it'll take 17,000 mana. See, because I'm not a human, I can't sell for the gold, see? Like, I'm not sure that the mana is always the best. Like, right now, I would love to be able to burn a card, grab a healing potion, and then go. But I think I have to do this side. Spelling the nightmare. Here we go, walking down the street. I've arrived. Oh, are these skeletons? Ooh, ooh, fancy. Oh, shit, man. I thought this was gonna be a simple quest. And I've got this purple goo on me, what is this? You can hit me that many times. I need two heals. This better give me extra gold. Clear a hard jogger camp. Oh, nice. Kind of fragment is that?
While below 70% health, it takes five seconds longer before gray health starts depleting. That might not be bad. We're going to get hatred here. Ah, we'll just eat it. It's a little hatred between our friends. Regain your lost health for one mana. Yes. Can you do that in combat? I'm guessing no. Because <laughs> that would be a little OP. <laughs> At the start of this, Bog says, let's go straight to the boss. Don't buff him. Bog's like, now fine, loot it all. It, I, I don't think you can ever pay attention to me if I say we're just going to go straight to the boss in this game. I don't think that'll ever, 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 ever happen. <laughs> I've tried it all day today. <laughs> it doesn't happen. Where's the quest guy? Give me more than a hundred. No! Give me more than a hundred, you scum. It's okay, we have the insta-heal. Let's go. Should we get a better weapon? I already sharpened the weapon I have. Already got better armor. Oh, look at this. True forged arms. 270. Damn. I guess I didn't need that after all because I got the card. Um, let's get two mana. We'll equip the Hunter's Figurine. Regain my lost health. And let's go. Let's go to do the boss. If we win, great. If we don't win, great. We're gonna wrap up the stream either way. We'll either save the run. Cause so I gotta get going. Um Where is Quest? Where is place? Which one is it? It's that one right there, right? Closest one. I know there's a gold weapon. This is the run meadow. Okay. Oh, I like how the sun rose above that statue. That was cool. If we lose, uninstall and pretend we never tried? No! Smack! Okay. See how it says zero of three blessings? Like what is I don't even know what that means. It feel it feels like I could go around and get blessings somehow before I come in here. That's how it feels. But I don't know how to get a blessing. Alright, here we go. Combat Sky. You got my back. The way the bridge rolls out is really, really interesting. All right, real quick, remind me, what do we got? We've got flint earrings, 70% stagger increase. And while below 70% health, it takes 5% seconds longer for the gray health to deplete. We've also got that and that. All right, I've got a dodge. I don't have an increased bubble.
five attacks. One, two, three. No, sometimes it's three. One, three, four. <laughs> that time it's four. I forget, I don't have the axes. The axes are quicker to attack. Oh. Glow more. Make me glow more. <laughs> There's so much ice skating going on. It's like boss fights ice capades. I said no. Did I beat you up while you're doing this? No. What was that? It looked like I splashed in some water. No, that's the move that I hate. Oh, you son of a biscuit. That move is the death of me for 100%. Okay. That sucks. We go we got closer. The I felt it. I felt the lack of damage I was doing. We didn't upgrade the weapon really. We did one little sharpening stone. I hit that guy 50 million times. <laughs> I hit him so much. <laughs> oh man, I know I did. Now I needed the needle. That's all I needed. Yeah, I had no needle. You did more damage than the other run still? Yeah, while well, I was surviving longer, but yeah. My dodging was so good. It was, it was better, it was better. It, um, I still feel like, uh, I still feel like while we're sliding all around, like some of the times <laughs> he's off the camera, I'm like, where am I? <laughs> it was a beautiful fight though. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a lot of fun. I, um, I look forward to, uh, to playing this some more and getting better at it and unlocking more things. Yeah. Clear out 50 camps. Do we unlock anything? Yeah, we do. We have a reward available. Clear a hard jogger camp. Ah, I didn't I never even I didn't even know that that was a thing. It's called fingers. Thank you, Arrowwolf. I forgot. You can't pretend you never tried. The internet is forever. That's true. That's true. They will always know about my failure. Thank you for the tip. Appreciate that. All right, so this is Draugr Deterring Armor. When taking damage from a Draugr Armor, increased by 100. Okay. All right. That's cool. Got some new armor for future runs. Um. Yeah, this is pretty amazing. Valley Duff, thanks for following. I would definitely like to play this more um, in the future. I'm definitely going to follow this game closely and... Uh, yeah, when this when this launches, we're gonna go we're gonna go crazy over this. This is awesome, gang. Thanks for being here today. Um, 
thanks to the devs for being here and hanging out with the stream and for sponsoring the, the game and cheering me on and giving us uh, hints and uh, answering questions for us. You guys were awesome. Uh, really appreciate opportunities like this. And uh, thanks for being here. We met a whole bunch of new new folks. Once again, my name is Richie, aka Bogotter. I'm a full-time uh, variety streamer here on Twitch. It's been seven and a half years since I've been doing this full-time. Would love to have you join us for other uh, streams. I stream uh, 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern, Monday through Friday. Uh, we play a huge variety of games. Roguelites, Souls-likes, AAA games, anything with a good story. Um, I play indie games. I play it all. And uh, we would love to see you. 